there are also reports of uh, you know a scarcity of rare earth materials coming in so will that be a you know a so challenge there there has been there? some uh, level of discussion on uh, the scarcity of material and i would like to split this up into three possible uh, three possible time zones hmm. there is a short term zone uh, there is a medium term zone and then there is a long term zone hmm. so in the short term i think we are protected uh, there is no problems right. with that in the medium term we are already uh, looking at uh, alternate sources hmm. and there are alternate sources that we can work with there may be a certain amount of uh, extra expense that uh, goes along with it, but it certainly would not hamper us okay. in, uh, in, a, in a very large way. Right. And then uh, in the longer run, technology can take care of itself because you have permanent magnetless uh, motors, traction drives. See, permanent magnets came at a particular point because you wanted to shrink the size, you wanted to improve the efficiency and you wanted to make the motors more powerful. You may have to give away some uh, of those enablements, mm. but uh, you could still uh, find solutions. Hmm. So that's how we see it. We uh, we would like to monitor this carefully. Uh, we wouldn't want to be complacent or anything. Hmm. Uh, but as of now, uh, we are uh, we are fairly okay.